is 5.07 a.m. I am gonna head out the door within the next like 10 to 15 minutes. I am about to start a three-day trip. I have layovers in Minneapolis and Las Vegas. So today we go Dallas to Chicago and then Chicago to Minneapolis and then we lay over there. And this one got up early with me today. Say hi, Luna. Nope, okay. So now I'm just getting my food ready for this trip. I have a strawberry protein smoothie that Eric made me last night. Some apples right there. And then those are some mini burrito bowls that I just mixed myself to have as meal prep for my trip. Just got to Minneapolis and it is cold here. It's 46 degrees out, which is obviously a lot chillier than Dallas right now. This morning on my flight though, I met a subscriber. It was so cool. His name is Byron and we actually took a selfie. This was the first time that someone on one of my flights or in the terminal or really just anyone in public has ever noticed me from my YouTube channel and recognized me. So I just thought it was like a really cool moment. And if any of you guys ever see me out and about in public, make sure that you come say hi because I really would like to meet all of you guys. So I think I'm just gonna hang out in the hotel for a while, eat some lunch, maybe go to the gym. The gym looked really small when I checked it out. So we'll see how much I'm able to do while I'm there. And then I'm probably gonna call it an early night because we do have a 5 a.m. van pickup tomorrow morning. Quick span of the room. I don't know if this was for me, but it is really cute. Um, it says, don't forget our trip advisor, thanks, Carrie. So I don't know if that was a previous guest at this hotel. So we have a chair right here, couch with a TV, and fridge is right in there. The bathroom looks really nice. Yeah, this is like a really cute bathroom. There's like some closet space right there, a large bed. I really like the wood paneling behind it. I think that's really cute with a TV right here. And then I love these things right here because you can put your suitcases on them. And the view is just of the parking lot. So sometimes on layovers we get hotels that have awesome and like really large gyms. And then sometimes you get hotels that have small ones like this, but you just make it work. So a few more people ended up coming to that gym and since it is so small, it ended up getting really crowded. I just walked on the treadmill for half an hour and now I am back up in my room and I'm just gonna stretch and do a little bit of a core circuit here. Good morning everyone, it is 4.50 a.m. so I have just a few minutes before I need to go downstairs for our pickup and head to the airport. Today we are flying from Minneapolis St. Paul to Phoenix and then Phoenix to Las Vegas. Our flight to Phoenix is blocked at three and a half hours so it's gonna be a bit of a long flight but I have not had a long Las Vegas layover and we have I think like an 18 or 19 hour layover tonight so I'm pretty excited. We just boarded our plane here in Phoenix, Arizona. The flight to Las Vegas is only gonna be about 45 to 50 minutes. The weather here is obviously a lot warmer than it was in Minneapolis this morning. It was so cold and so rainy. I am super excited to get to Vegas where the weather will also be really warm. This is a really interesting hotel room. So you walk in and there's water bottles and stuff and then you have a fully stocked mini fridge, of course, it is Vegas. And the bathroom has an interesting picture above the toilet. It is a really pretty and like modern looking bathroom though. Really nice shower as well. And then when you come through here, there's a chair right here and the famous like Las Vegas mirror, every flight attendant takes a picture in front of this mirror. Everyone thinks it's super cool. And then you have a couch in front of the bed and this is like a really interesting picture to go above the bed. It looks like it's just people cheering. Yeah, and then there's another mirror on this side and a TV with a desk. What's really interesting about this mirror too is there's a power button. So if you just push this button right here, it turns the lights off and then if you push the button again, it turns the lights back on. 
So the flight to Vegas was really quick. It was only 45 minutes. We're here now and it's before noon, which is awesome. My parents actually live here in Las Vegas, but my mom's out of town, but my dad is here. So I'm gonna go hang out with him. So my plans are to just hang out with my dad today. We might grab some lunch or dinner or go see a movie. But yeah, so you guys will probably get to meet my dad. So apparently downstairs in the hotel by the bathrooms, you can get your fortune told to you by this creepy mannequin thing. You can have your fortune, prenup advice, or marriage advice. And I'm assuming that you just put coins in right there. <laughs> yeah, this is funny. Everyone meet my dad. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> So I just got back to my room after hanging out with my dad. Normally I would just stay the night at home, but I have to get up at 3.30 in the morning and I didn't want to have to make my dad drive me to the airport that early in the morning, so I am staying at the hotel tonight. We ended up going to eat at Cafe Rio and then we saw the movie Joker. That was one of the most intense movies I think I've ever seen in my life. I'm honestly a little nervous that I'm gonna have a nightmare tonight, but I'll just call Eric. And the movie was honestly incredible. Like it was so well done. The actor who played the Joker was phenomenal like I definitely think it's gonna win a lot of awards it was just really really intense and definitely not what I was expecting but for me it was just really intense and there was a lot of violence and it was pretty scary so I bought this Las Vegas Christmas ornament I think that's really cute and then this is also the magnet that I bought it's a little martini that says Las Vegas on it and has some cards in it and some dice good morning everyone it is 4 25 a.m. so I am about to head downstairs so we can take the van to the airport we have a 6 a.m. departure we are flying from Las Vegas to Dallas and then Dallas to San Diego and then San Diego back to Dallas. So today is a 12 and a half hour duty day. So my day starts at 6 a.m. here in Vegas and it doesn't end until 7.30 p.m. in Dallas tonight. So today's gonna be a bit of a long day, but it is day three of my three day trip. So it is go home day. just boarded my plane to San Diego. I am really tired, I don't care what time zone it is, getting up in the middle of the night is really hard. And I'm definitely feeling it, so hopefully I'll have like some sort of energy boost in the middle of this flight. The flight here was two hours long, and I believe the flight to San Diego is about two and a half hours, so I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. I know I can, I'm just trying to stay positive and happy and keep my energy up. So we made it to San Diego safe and sound. It was a two and a half hour flight. However, now we are stuck in San Diego for at least another hour before we can start boarding because there is a really big storm that is heading towards Dallas. It hasn't hit Dallas yet, but it's on its way there. So air traffic control is holding aircraft until the storm clears. So hopefully we are able to make it back to Dallas tonight. I am so sad and mad at myself. So I was trying to adjust the magnets on my fridge and I dropped this one from Coco K in the Bahamas. So I'm really hoping I can get some super glue and fix it because this was one of my favorite magnets. But for now, I will just put the new Vegas magnet up. So last night we ended up only being delayed about an hour, which was really nice because I was super nervous that we weren't going to be able to land in DFW. They were already starting to cancel flights. One of my crew members actually needed to commute back to Minneapolis last night and his flight canceled. He was going to try and fly on a different airline, so I really hope he made it. But anyways, I am home now and I am off for about the next six days and I am actually going on a trip with my sister. I'm super excited about it. So make sure that you guys stay tuned for those vlogs, which will probably be uploaded by 
by the end of October. So I'm going to conclude the vlog here, but thank you everyone so, so, so much for watching this video and for supporting my channel. If you liked it, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you never miss any of my travel tips and adventures. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>